Okay now, I have taken my gun and have put it in the uh, put it in the arm the hand, excuse me, like that and I have finished my flesh tone and what I did was I took a little uh, what happened, my battery failed on me and I didn't get what I wanted to I took a little white now what, what I did on the, on the beard was I took a little white and mixed it down and then put it over the hair to make the, the beard look more of an aged look. I'm so sorry that my battery failed on me. And then I took a pin, much like these little push, these not, they're not push pins now, that little, uh, pins like this, with the heads on them, and I used those to put the uh, Payne's gray I use for the eyes and then I put a little white along the side of it in other words okay now um, of course as we look at the figure in other words and I'm taking a little red I want to use a little red around the um, after I put the flesh tone on, I'll come back with a little bit of red just to uh, give it a little bit more color. Now, if the eyes are not dry, don't put it over the eyes or anything like that, in other words. Just to give a little bit of color like that. And the knife is done, and what I will do is I will glue the knife on there, a little super glue. And then I will show you as I dip it into the antiquing solution what it does to the color of... Uh, now the antiquing solution, a lot of people ask me what it is. I have it on my blog, uh, how to mix it up. I use a combination of boiled linseed oil Miracle Spirits, about, uh, uh, you can buy boiled linseed oil and I think a quart jar, I think they're quarts, cans. And I take half of the bottle of mineral spirits, which is like a thinner, and I pour it into the boiled linseed oil. And then I go down to Hobby Lobby, and the picture's on my blog, it's flatplanecarver.com. And I um, put about a, uh, well, you, as you mix it, in other words, kind of look at the darkness that you want, in other words. You mix in some, um, at Hobby Lobby they have, it, this is the oil paint, it's in a tube, it's burnt umber. Now a lot of people use raw, raw, raw sierra, I use burnt umber because I like the darker uh, contrast to it. And uh, I use about probably a quarter of a tube, half a tube, something like that, uh, for the burnt umber. And I mix it together and make a dark oil-like that I dip my carvings in. I call it, it's called an antiquing solution. Uh, Boil linseed oil is very dangerous. What I'm saying is don't do this in the house, folks. Do it in your garage or whatever, but um, because it's very flammable and stored in a place where it's not near flame or anything like that. And when you get through, and I'll, I'll explain that later whenever I, uh, we actually do it, in other words. You discard your um, rags and everything like that. Okay. All right. Well, we're, our next uh, video will be of the antiquing solution as I show you. And here's our little... Civil War figure.